So Scott, you're getting quite used to these uh, penalty shootouts now. No, not really. Uh, <laughs> it's it's uh, amazing when you come through them and you win. It's um, you know, very, very disappointing when you don't. And you know, I, I respect the the Valour players and. Um, Having you know seen the, the amount of work they put into the, the game tonight, and it's never never easy. They've got a lot of young players, so never easy for young players to go through that and um, and not get through. But that said, I've got to be delighted with um, with our players and the commitment, the the, the amount of work um, they put in um, as a as a team, as a squad, all completely together. Uh, just loving seeing them enjoy playing and. Um, Getting that success from from that game and getting into the last 32 is great. You said when the draw was made that Valour away was probably one of the toughest you could have had. Did that turn out exactly as you expected? Yeah, it did. It did. Um, I remember playing Eskilstuna um, early on at my time at City, and it felt quite similar. The, the, the sort of standard you were playing against, the type of player, and um, and yeah, we 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 did a lot of homework on on Valour, but. You know, n nothing's like actually going out there and actually playing them and seeing it up close and personal, how athletic they are, how quick they are, how well organised they are, the good players that they've got, the quality they've got. And, you know, our, our players matched that. I thought in the first half um, we should have had the game put to bed, really. We had, you know, a number of um, opportunities. It was just about making sure that we, we latched on properly and, and put the goalkeeper under more pressure. Then, obviously, um, it was great to, to get the goal. And uh, at that point, you know, when Valour have lost the goal, they reacted really well. They went higher press, they had more energy, and um, it took us a little while to, to get going again after that. And uh, I think then it, when it gets into the, the extra time, yeah, there's still maybe opportunities for both teams. But um, it did have the, the sort of look of a game that was going to go to penalties. And um, yeah, you know that we've had a fair share of uh, penalty shootouts that have gone really badly for us and um, and we've now had some good ones so it's it's nice when a team put in that much effort that they, they get through and I'm, I'm really proud of the players. Also, as you said, Valour equalised not long before full time setting it in extra time. How was that in terms of you at full time speaking to the players, make sure that they didn't get too disheartened after the performance they'd put in? Yeah, I mean, I think the one thing that we probably didn't do after we'd scored was we stopped passing the ball, um, we stopped stretching them, and they were able to press us easier because we were a bit narrow. Um, we were kind of going down their throats a little bit, and that was their game. They were able to just nick in there and then. The first pass they, they play forward was always in behind, so it's a race. But I thought our um, our back four in particular were, were fantastic when it when they needed to be. Um, that was not an easy game to defend in, but I mean I think you know if everyone did their their bit, and um, again the ones that have to step up and take penalties as well have to um, you know be really confident. And yeah, because it it kind of went on past five, you're, you're kind of thinking, wow, this is now really right down to the wire. Um, but just delighted to finally get that nod and we're, we're through, so it's good. Obviously, reaching the last 32, it's the 10th consecutive year for the club at that stage. Back to two-legged games in Europe. Are you looking forward to yeah. being able to test against some of the best yeah. over two legs again? Yeah, I mean, to be to be fair and, and to be honest, I, I felt that was like a, a last 32 game we've just played. I think both both teams, um, on the basis of what they've shown tonight, should be through the last 32, but only one could make it. So yeah, it's, it's going to be interesting. It's not going to be any easier than what we've just had. And, um, you know, we, we do hope for a, a, a good draw, um, a draw that gives us a chance. I mean, there's a lot of big clubs in there. I'm not really quite sure how the seeding um, works for it yet, but I'll find that out. And yeah, we'll we'll look at the the draw, and um, yeah, we'll you know have great anticipation when we're watching.